Tonight, a community is mourning the loss of a high school student who died as a result of an accidental drowning last Sunday. That student, Christian Scott, was approaching his sophomore year at Pickerington North. NBC4 Sierra Johnson joins us now. Sierra family, friends, and coaches are remembering this young athlete. That's right. Those who knew him best, his family and coaches, tell me there isn't just one word to describe the teen. He was outgoing with a very contagious smile, but his family said tonight the world is a little darker following the loss of 15-year-old Christian Scott. We lost uh, a very vital piece of our family. As Brandon Scott works to find the words to describe his nephew, he struggles. He tells us the teen was so much to so many, but those closest to him would say he's simply one of a kind. Christian was one of the best. Like He was one of a kind. He really was. In stature, in personality, he was just a cool dude. Just weeks away from starting his sophomore year, Scott's family is now preparing for life without the vivacious student athlete. Oh, let's go! According to Pickerington School, Scott was involved in a water accident on Sunday and after fighting at Nationwide Children's Hospital, died three days later. He had a lot of things stacked against him. You know, and one of the things like him dealing with epilepsy and you will never not see him smiling. The loss of Scott's smile is being felt by his teammates on Pickerington North's varsity football team, a team preparing to take the field in just weeks, this time without number 13. Obviously, I changed the diapers before and, and helped raise him, so it's probably hitting us a little bit harder, but I know how he touches people, you know, and everybody he meets is his family. So I can just imagine what these players are going through. The family says they are grateful for the support of the Pickerington community, staff, student, as well as the coaches. Scott's uncle tells us it will help to keep the heart of their family alive. I know I ain't going to be able to see him out on the field this year, but I know he'll be there in spirit. I, I know that 100%. School leaders say they will have grief counselors available to students and staff who may need additional support at both Lakeview Junior High and Pickerington North tomorrow from 8 a.m. to 3. Colleen.